so intense. There it is. Now I have grown up to the mountains once again and looking for the red start. I cannot wait to uh, put up my blind and hopefully get some images of this beautiful bird. It's a, a lot of mittens and mosquitoes. Uh, <laughs> this is the like typical time of the year when they are starting to the female is starting to lay eggs and they are like really, really all over the place. But I'm going to be inside a blind and hopefully none of the none of the mosquitoes will be there. You see it? Put up my blind in a really like difficult place where it's so steep and slope in that li this little hillside here and the reason why is because I wanted to come uh, at a high level uh, to some of the perches at, that I seen the red start is using so uh, <laughs> therefore I needed to uh, put it in this slope here oh there it is I found a really good spot here. There is like a stick where I saw it used over and over and over and again to uh, sit and spot insects. Uh, it's a perfect place. It's like, I think it may be, be in uh, the family of, of flycatchers because I've seen it uh, catches insects in the air. Uh, so that perch there, it's perfect. Oh, this is so exciting. Great bird to photograph. It's so colorful with that bright red and the black and the gray and together with the white on the uh, forehead as well. This makes a beautiful bird to photograph. I'm going to spend the rest of the day here. I am around ISO 800 F4 and my shutter speed is, let me see here, it's uh, around 1000 and a 1250 of a second and that should freeze uh, some movements of the birds. Since it's using uh, the this, this, this same purchase uh, over and over again, I'm going to try to uh, focus on that perch and uh, have a little bit higher ISO so I get enough shutter speed and try to like getting some landing shots of that beautiful bird. So yeah, I focused on uh, that perch now and I have f5.6 to get a little bit more depth of feel and ISO 1600 and then I get around 2000 of a second and that should uh, be enough to freeze some action. Oh, here it is.
I actually saw on the forecast that it's going to be overcast today with some small raindrops but right now it's more uh, sun than clouds so I'm fighting a little bit against the sun because the sun is way too high to get any cool pictures with the bird that with direct sun it's uh, midday and uh, summertime then it's going to be too much of a harsh shadow some of the perches are um, in part shadow and then I can get some background uh, lit up by the sun that would be cool though but the best thing would be the overcast this is so intense you like sitting in this slow pair it's not a good position for my body to sit but still it's so awesome and so worth it it's such a beautiful bird and I'm so happy that this bird was a lot more beautiful than last year so I have moved a little bit and I didn't want to take my blind with me but I'm going to use the telephone teleconverter to get some closer such a high humidity I'm sweating <laughs> oh, here it comes here it comes here it comes bird is so colorful and I love that so this was an awesome session here and I'm going home uh, there it is so easy distracted I don't want to go home but I have to uh, it's a long drive uh, home so I hope, hope you enjoyed this and I will see you in the next one bye